Hello dears, welcome back to my channel. Uh, again, I represent you a very important lesson. Uh, it is very helpful for you. It is apostrophe and its uses. Uh, in English grammar, apostrophe is known as possessive, possessive pronoun or possessive noun. However, what is apostrophe? We know uh, apostrophe uh, can be different types. It is expressed by symbol. It is expressed by S, it is expressed by pronoun or preposition. Its work for relation to to ownership or possessions, etc. However, uh, before uh, going to start my uh, lesson, uh, request to you please subscribe if you are new to my channel and hit the bell button to get new not notification of my next lesson. So, let's start. How do you identify apostrophe? Because there, uh, the apostrophe sometimes works for contraction, sometimes works for falsations. How do you identify? The nature of apostrophe, if we express it by symbol, it is this way, such as it's this way we have to use. It is not like comma. It is different from comma. It is comma is used lower side and same apostrophe is uses e, use the word in upper side. So by symbol it is apostrophe. Then letter sometimes we use apostrophe plus s or, th or apostrophe s apostrophe or s apostrophe s apostrophe s or s apostrophe. Both sides are right. Then the function of apostrophe in some cases in some grammar in grammar uh, we uh, saw some words pronoun uh, my his our your they are these are work for possessive ownerships relation relationship then the preposition of work for possessive and the word belongs to also expresses the possession. So the function, why, how the apostrophe works in sentence, works in words to show the possessions or ownership like the books belongs to John, the bo John's books, the, the phrase expresses the book is belongs to John or the John is the owner of these books. It work for possession or ownership here in to show relation. Possessive also work for showing relation. Where is the Raihan's book? Here the books is related with Raihan. So here apostrophe s indicate the relations. Then the third things to show the contractions shan't, won't, couldn't, didn't, haven't, ain't, aren't, these to make, to make contraction we use apostrophe. However, the nature of apostrophe, apostrophe uh, in grammar, apostrophe uses a singular, sometimes uses in plural, it has difference, we uh, feel some confusions in some cases. So, by showing example, I hope you can remove your confusions on apostrophe and its uses. Singular, when we use any apostrophe with singular noun like doctor's patient, here doctor is singular and doctor is common noun. Here we add just apostrophe plus s. Always remember when we find any common noun or singular noun, we use apostrophe plus s. Doctor's patient, here the patient of doctor, here a car's engine, the engine of car. So, here car is singular, so it takes the apostrophe and s 
to make the possessions or ownership. Then another way, uh, the uh, apostrophe uses sometimes in floral, uses with floral. For example, the ladies hostel. Here, ladies, ladies is floral. Uh, the girls schools, girls is plural. So here we add just apostrophe symbol, not as. Then the bus wheels here, the bus though the bus is singular, we use just apostrophe to avoid the repetition of letter or repetition of words. Then the uh, third format, when we find any proper noun, proper noun can take both apostrophe or apostrophe as. For example, John's house, here already we find the S, so we do not repeat it, we can, we may use, we can use apostrophe S or John's, just the symbol of apostrophe John's house, both are correct. Citizens, cities, here we included apostrophe S. If we use the letter way, cities, here S already uh, shown here, we just add apostrophe symbol, not repeat the S. Exceptional, in some cases, uh, the apostrophe uses in exceptional, uh, though we utter before singular takes apostrophe S, floral takes just apostrophe. But here it is difference. Children's children, the word children is plural, but yet we use apostrophe plus s and then men's means mean the word mean is plural, but we again use apostrophe s works. It is grammatically correct. So in this way we can use uh, apostrophe. When we find two more words at a time to describe, uh, how do we explain? Here, two names, Jam Kamal and Jamal book. How do we use apostrophe? Which word follow apostrophe, takes apostrophe? The last noun, last subject takes apostrophe, Jamal's. So, here uh, this way we can use more noun, uh, this way we can use apostrophe in la last subject, last noun. Hope you guys do clear the apostrophe and its uses. But remember, when apostrophe follows noun, okay and works like noun, when we find any, it's nice. Here, apostrophe s is not indicated, the possessions or ownership or relation. Here, it's means is. So, be careful. Sometimes it uses auxiliary, sometimes apostrophe uses for contraction, sometimes possessions. Uh, Hope you love my next content. Till then, thank you very much for watching my channel.